Hello everybody, I'm in the Littlewood, also known as Martin. Welcome back to the channel. So today we are playing the sequel to one of my favourite games ever. So last year a game came out called Grow Home, where you played as this cool little robot over here, Bud. Uh, it stands for botanical, and then I don't know the other two sciencey words. Uh, but essentially, you're dropped onto this island from your spaceship, and you had to grow this beanstalk all the way back up into space, and you had to collect loads of stuff along the way, and you gained various different abilities as you went on. There were sheep and bulls and all sorts of stuff and they did a sequel very very fast so I'm gonna jump straight into this I'm so excited for it I've heard that there are a ton of new abilities you can now get various different skins all sorts of stuff and we're on a brand new botanical expedition discovery and recovery of interesting bioforms it's day 1803 but yeah, I'm so excited for this. I'm playing this on the uh, the PlayStation 4. And my last time when I played this, I played it on Steam. So I'm going to have to get used to moving from win a Windows controller to this. But we'll see how it goes. What? We've lost at Noughts and Crosses for the 12,000th time. Do you want to play again? Uh, really, bud? You still want to go at it? All right. Okay. I spy. <laughs> There's not really a lot in space. Although certainly meteors... Oh, jeez. I was wondering why after we repa repaired the spaceship, we never have to drop back down onto a planet. Oh, I think we're going to get hit real hard. Oh, careful! Oh, damn. Reflections. A Ubisoft Studio presents... Grow Up. Oh, I'm so excited. There are various different skins that you can now get as well, and I think there are actually a window of time where you can actually submit, like, fan-made ones, which is really cool. And I think they've got, on that title screen when I loaded the game up, it spoke about something called Ubisoft Club, where I think you can actually accumulate points and you get other in-game unlocks, so whenever that becomes available, it seemed to fail when I tried to do it this time around. Probably when the game is officially released is when you can start, like, you know, collecting all of those together. But we're very quickly falling into the atmosphere, and we're going to crash land right onto the rocks because if you don't remember you can't actually swim as bud or at least we couldn't before so it's the left stick to move it's right stick to move the camera around uh right trigger is right arm left trigger is left arm so it's kind of like it's weird it's quite gangly like the arms all kind of move as and when you want them to um r1 doesn't seem to do anything l1 doesn't seem to do anything x is the jump oh and we found pod oh that is cool look at that a planet obs observation droid. It's booted up and it's initialized. Oh, hello. Do you like the planets? I'm Pod. I like planets and optics and orbits. Loads of things, really. Press uh, the touchpad to access Pod View. Oh my god. Of course, drones had to be in this. Oh, you can see through my eyes. That's disconcerting. Move with L. So we can look around. Oh, there you go. Use R to zoom in on things on the planet. Ooh, yep, yeah, that's weird. Is that, was that a mob over there as well? I think it was. I know what that is. It's a tub. Oh, we got health tubs. Now, I think it's a teleportation something or other. I always know the first word of these, like, abbreviations, but nothing else. Right, let's do it. Let's exit out of that mode. We're going to run on over to, uh, to that pod. So it seems like we're all out of our abilities. And obviously you can like grab onto things to climb up them. But yeah, before we had like a hang glider, we had a jetpack, all kinds of things. But it looks like we've lost all of those. Mum must have dropped this. Oh, mum. That was a terrible crash. <laughs> Poor mum. She'll be okay. All right. Oh, a Floridex 3000. A Floridex scans, records, and reproduces the DNA of a useful flora forms. It makes seeds, basically. That was it. We had to get lots of seeds before. It's pretty much the Floridex 2000, but in a nicer case. All right, cheers, bro. Do we want to jump into his view again or not? Oh, there you go, abilities. So now we've got Floriform Photocopier. Sure thing. So what can we do? Can we grab one of these and take it into the teleporter? Oh, there you go. So wait, do I have to grab it first and then hold square? Oh, I see. I have to put my hands on it. A champoline springy form fungus. Okay, that's pretty interesting. Press square to throw a seed. Oh, look at that. Whoa, my God. Wait. So if I grab another one, like so, and then press square again. Oh, wait. It didn't work that time. Maybe I can only do it the once. Unless I can pick that one back up. 
No, I can't. But I was just able to duplicate it. So that's kind of interesting. And I'm guessing that this is going to be like before where if I just do left and right, yeah, it like slowly climbs up stuff. And yeah, because this is a springy form, flora form, then I'm going to go really high. Oh, I can throw again. Oh, do I have to wait for the batteries to recharge in the bottom left? Ah, you do. Okay. Oh, jeez. Hold on. Hold on. There you go. I'm just going to drop off of that. Right, so that's the first thing that we've learned how to do so far. Let's jump back up into um, into the drone and see if there's anything else to be found. It says there's a crystal there. So in the last game, there were loads of crystals to collect. Like, I played this game, I think, three times in full completion. So, like, I just would play this in the evenings in my own time. I absolutely adored it. It's one of those ones you could just really zone out to. Right, there we go. And to grab the crystals before, it was just a case of grabbing them. And you just sort of yank it out the wall. There you go. And when you get a certain number of crystals, you get different abilities. So crystals help power your systems like breakfast cereal, but harder to chew. <laughs> okay, sure. It's a pretty tough mineral. So where else are we going to go? Does it show us anything if we zoom in on those guys? No? Okay, fair play. Uh, where do we want to go? Aha! And it, oh, whoa, I zoomed in way too far. Right, so we want to go up that way. So there is... There is a string of trampolines there. So I kind of want to go forward and up to the right somewhat. I like that the camera angle does go with you as well, so you can sort of figure out where it is you want to go. So it, it's kind of telling me I want to go onto that rock. So if I throw down a trampoline, I could probably grab onto that. So let's give this a go. So throw you down to there. Oh, this is cool. See, this is already one of the abilities that we didn't have in the last game, so I'm already super chuffed about it. There you go. Left, right, left, right, hook! Faster, Corporal! Come on! Or Lieutenant. Or even Private. Private would probably be a better one. You wouldn't usually shout at a Lieutenant. There you go. Go on. Up you get. Nice. Couple more to go. I don't think I need to use any more of the spring forms just yet. I think as well, does my backpack change icon depending on what I have inside of it at the moment? Like, cause I, don't, I didn't really take much notice of it in the first place. Oh, it's even tracking my greatest height as well. So this is the highest I've been up in the world. Oh, dude. So I'm wondering this time if we're going to be growing to space or if we're going to have to repair the ship and then take off from the surface. Oh, I don't know. There was a crystal over there as well. I saw one just in the uh, just in the distance. Oh, of course, this thing like last time, you have to grab each of the, uh, the arms of it and pull this bad boy open. There you go. And then grab. Oh, geez, there you go. It's almost like walking with ice beneath your feet when you run around as bud. I let go of that then really quickly, but he still seem, seemed to be grabbing onto it. Right, there you go. Into tub. Yeah, boy. Oh, we got the jetpack. Yeah. Engage while jumping. Oh, yes. I didn't think we'd get the jetpack that quickly. Oh, dude, this is awesome. Right, Skyview. What else is there to collect? We could try and make our way up there. There is a crystal there, but not a lot else. There's a pod challenge. A pod challenge? Okay, interesting. There's a pod challenge down there. Um, oh, the drone is actually there. Wait, aren't we supposed to be looking through the drone's eyes? <laughs> it shouldn't be visible on the screen when we're in his eyes. Unless it's a second drone that's over there. Mm, there's a crystal there as well. I tell you what, if I carry on forwards towards that dude, we'll see what happens. So, build up some momentum. Oh, and I see the battery in the bottom left corner is representative of how much jetpack charge we got left. That's fine. That's a star plant. Right, so this is going to be exactly like last time then. But there's something up here. Oh, what's going on? Oh, wow. Okay, sure. It's a piece of the ship. Hey, it's a piece of mum. Okay, sure. So it's going to be exactly the same as before where we actually have to jump on these random beanstalk type things and guide them into the rocks that glow. And then that basically like feeds energy into like the life tree or the beanstalk itself. Uh, I'm keeping track of every piece you find. Press R1. Oh, dude. Okay, sure thing. Let's find the ship parts to get to the moon and save mum. Right. Awesome. X to set a waypoint. Ah, and then he puts like a massive thing up in the world. And there's a challenge there as well. I think that's a challenge or it might be an ability. I'm not sure just yet. But we'll get ourselves over there. So let's have a little run over this way. We'll go on one of those little beanstalky things again and see what we can do. I feel like I maybe should have gone to the right to get all the crystals. But for today, I think I just kind of want to show off the various different abilities that are on hand rather than worrying about trying to be a completionist just to begin with because that's probably something I'll do in my own time to be honest I'm hoping this game is coming to PC again I reckon it will do I'd be very surprised if it didn't there you go so what's this one is this another flora form hold on hold square there you go 
A flungus. That's a clever name. Flungus, part of the catapoid family of flora forms that throw things. Oh, I love the, <laughs> the hyphens between all of them. You should pronounce it all as one word. Uh, that's disgusting. It's like a tongue or something. Ugh. Now I know what a tongue is. All right. Fair play. Oh, no. He really did get me. Oh, jeez. Oh, uh-oh. Okay. I thought I was going to take way more damage there than I did. Uh, that's not good. I don't really want to plant the seed right now, do I? Oh, jeez. Let's see what happens. Which way is this going to launch me? Oh, it, oh, oh, jeez. Okay. That was all right. That did us some good. Because it's gotten us over to this thing. It's not the waypoint we were going for, but whatever. It's fine. There you go. Grab the floor form and press circle. Wait, what? Why circle? Hmm. I'm just going to pull all of these down first real quick. There you go. Nice. Right, pod. This is a handy respawn point. Nice. It does respawn and it's very good at it. So can I respawn at any time? I can't remember from the last game what the crack with that was. Oh my god. Oh the god, there's so many abilities around. Can I set a waypoint to that as well? Waypoint to you. Oh, I can only set one, one waypoint at a time though. Oh, damn. Okay, never mind. There's a star plant up there. There's a teleporter just there as well. Oh, you know what it is? I think you can only move between the teleporters. I remember now. If I hold onto that and press square, what? Pod, a sturdy tall flora form that should support your weight while climbing. Okay, sure thing. Tell you what, before we go climbing, I just wanna, oh, whoa, hold on a minute. That's another ability here, so grab you, press square. There you go, if I press circle. Ah, yeah, it does, if I press circle again, it does the same as before. So it actually gives me it. What was that called again? I didn't get the name of it. Oh, I forgot I can't swim. <laughs> Completely forgot. I should not have pressed circle on that. At least I respawn right here, though. That's fine. Oh, oh, that's a launcher. Which way does that go, though? Oh, no, that's wrong. Do I need to wait for it to charge for a moment? Is that what it is? Let's try again. What? What do you, <laughs> what do you mean? You were supposed to launch me, not just pulverize me. Yeah, let's climb up the star plant and see what we can do. There we go. And then another big old jump. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Aha! That's what we wanted. That's what we wanted. Hold on. Hold on tight. Right. So I can grab on it and then press square to grow. Gotcha. So if I do that all the way over to that thing just there. No, down, 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 down. I forgot how to steer this thing. It's inverted. I'm not used to inverted controls. Oh, I shouldn't have pressed skipped. Ah. I was holding square, so it ended up skipping the animation. Although I can see it from this angle instead, so I guess that's fine. And yeah, I've basically just got to continually do that until... Oh, are you a UFO? No, I think you're okay. So yeah, you can see the other star plants that branch off of the main one. So there's another energy cell just up there. I think there might be one to the right. Yeah, yeah. They do grow quite far. So I basically got to keep doing that until I get to the next, like, you know, large plane. Or at least the next teleporter. There you go. There's another hot tub all sorted. What's inside of that one? Uh, tap triangle in the air to open air brakes. Oh, it's the petal thing. Oh, yes. And I don't think that one actually has a, um, like a battery on it. Yeah, that one just lasts as long as it does. Although it does, never seems to kick in first time. It's always on my second press. Tap, tap. Yeah, that's weird. That's going to annoy me, actually. Because I'm going to press it out of panic and I'm not going to get it. Can I hold square on you? No, I can't absorb the carrot. Okay, never mind. Why do I hear a twinkling? I think there must be a crystal nearby. Let me go into sky view. Oh, it's right behind me. How did I not see that? Where was it? Oh, it's right there. It's just because everything in this game is just so bright and bold. You end up missing stuff sometimes. Right, so where do we want to go to next? Should we just carry on heading up there? Let's see if there's another ability nearby. So we've got that one. That's the star plan. There's a teleporter just there. Hmm. Although there is a pod challenge on the ground floor that I quite like to go to. Oh, that ability is so far away. I love that you get this planet view this time as well, though. Oh, there's even an Arctic area. Oh, man. Oh, I'm really excited about this. I'm really chuffed with it. Oh, here we go. We've got a slight deserty area. Look at the, look at those cacti. <gasps> there's even a cacti star plant. I wonder if you have to, like, get something where you don't get hurt by them. Oh, it looks like you can set a waypoint anywhere. I thought you could only set a waypoint on particular objectives. What's that over there? Is that a crystal? Let's go get that crystal for now, then. There's a crystal dead ahead of us on the other island, so we can get that piece of cake. Uh, what I do want to check is how do I go about changing... Ah, I see. So you hold square, and it brings up the menu for the various different um, plants that you have. And then let's see what happens. So the battery recharges. 
There you go. Oh my god, when you're this high up, the world actually bends away from you. That's crazy. There you go. Over to there. That was a real big jump, but I'm being brave, and we nailed it. There's another crystal for us. So when we get to 10, we'll get a power level upgrade, which will be good. There you go, yoink. Four out of 150. Oh, it's going to be like Pokemon. Got to catch them all. Where is the next energy? Co oh, there's one just there, actually. So if I can go this way and hop on to the next star plant, I could probably route that back around. That one itself might not reach it, but the next one after it may well manage it. So that's it. If I go like that, up to there. Oh, no, actually, this has still got loads of growth left in it. I reckon this will just make it. Go on, just about reach, just about reach. Yeah, boy! Now the main tree is going to grow again. Oh, I'm going to hold on for a second. Can I turn the camera to have a look at the growth? Yeah, there it is. We're almost at, like, the second plane already, which is nuts. The star plant is up to 382 of 750. That's ridiculous. Right, let's climb up this little platform. I don't even know if there's anything on it, but I'm sure there will be. Aha, so there's a teleporter up here. Come on, then, dude. So now I can teleport back up to this platform from any other teleporter whenever I wish, which is good. It's a nice way of traversing up and down the world. Oh, there's a new ability up there that I don't have yet. Okay, hold on a second. Oh, jeez. Climb over the top. Nice, there we go. So what are you? Let me grab a hold of you. You are a flora form that ejects pollen at a staggering velocity, and it's really, really grotty. Okay. So what do I do? Stand in it, and it launches me up? Oh! <laughs> Oh, wow. Hold on a second. Triangle. Oh, dude. That's at me flying. Oh, that's so cool. So I'm thinking if I go... Where do I want to go? I don't think this runs out either, so I'm just going to enjoy the, the scenery for a moment. Oh, there is a crystal over there. Do you reckon I can fly that far? Oh, I hope I can. I'm going to risk it. I'm going for it. Oh, the camera angle. Because the world wraps away from you, it does sort of like mess with your eyes a little bit. It's really strange. I like it, though. There we go, another crystal. We're not even, like, specifically searching for them. We're just coming across them by chance quite a lot. There you go. Five out of 150. That's across to you. Oh, maybe a little babby hop there. There you go. I'm going to go for round number two with this thing. And the moment I get to the peak, there you go. I'm going to activate that. Oh, oh, jeez. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Let go too soon. I reckon if I go to that star plant that I'm drifting down towards... I reckon I can run that into uh, into an energy island. So let's keep on going. Because there's an energy island just above me there. So it might take two or three branches of the star plant. But we'll definitely get there. Just thought I'd throw myself forwards a bit there. There you go. All right. Where's the star plant? There it is. That's who I was looking for. Um, I'm just going to hold square right away. Oh, I have to grab the top of the plant. My bad. Right. Okay. So hold down so I can steer this thing upwards. There we go. Yeah, look. See, because I don't think that will quite reach. It only grows for about, I would say, like, five seconds or so, for the most part. I love as well that, because the platform is growing as it moves, my little feet are, like, <laughs> my little feet are moving along. It's so good. Uh, what is that down there it's trying to notify me of? Oh, that's another one of the things. There you go. So if I hold on to that, and then just drift down a little bit, please grab onto that. <laughs> that was brave. If I hadn't have caught that, I would have fallen all the way back down to the earth. No, 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 no. We're going upwards, dude. We're going upwards. Oh, I've messed up. I've messed up. Where's the island? Oh, the island's over there. Ooh, we might just reach. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Towards it. Towards it. Towards it. Go on. It's the tiniest little bit. Oh, come on. Right. It's going to show me, though, where the next one is. Uh, Right. The next one is just there, actually. So if I toggle that off. Oh, jeez. Grab onto you. Okay, this one's got to be a pretty sharp U-turn at the beginning. So, round to the left. I'm going to hold it up as well. That's it. Nice sky high. Straight into you. I'm a bit of a weird sign angle for that, but there you go. I regained my center of gravity there. So, that's three out of five to get us up to the uh, the first plane. I do hear a crystal. I think it might actually be under all these rocks just here. So, let's have a little go. I sort of have to grab it and jump around like a madman, but I get them all off there. Come on. Come on, bud. This is one of the only times as well where me calling everything bud is actually going to be relevant. Like, is one of my go-to words when I'm just describing any, like, like an animal object or, like, creature in a game or anything. What's that? What's that? I want to know what that is. That looks cool. I want to know what it is. That is... That's a teleporter. 
That's a ship part. Of course, yeah, that's the first part we were going to. See that energy island over there? I kind of want to go to it. Also, because there's a crystal on it. And also because there is a teleporter just there as well. Can I get on the underside of that? Oh, no, I missed, I missed it up. I missed it up. I messed it up. <laughs> I royally messed up there. That's fine. Grab onto it. There we go. All right, let's go up to that island. That wasn't the best performance right there. I think I went actually past two branches of the star plant. This thing is really hauling ass. Really? That's going to get to it? Oh, dude. Okay. I I'm in. We've only got to get one more energy island and we'll have the five out of five. We'll have our first ship part by the end of this video. Now, do I? Oh, last time I went on one of these, it killed me, but I'll trust in it. Oh, wait. Okay, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me stand on it. Let me get comfy. Nope, that one's going to also kill me. Oh, this thing is dangerous. There we go. That'll work. Yes. Nice. Keep going. Oh, look at the skydiving skills. Grab on. Dude, bud, you made it. That's incredible. Uh, that one I already have the ability of, but here is a brand new teleporter. We have got nowhere near our waypoint, by the way, have we? Look, that, that beam, of, <laughs> beam of light over there. Just not bothered. So where is the last energy island that we need? Oh, yeah, the teleporter's active. Yeah, is there another energy island around here somewhere? Hmm, I like that they glow in the dark as well. The ones that actually are rideable. You know what? There's actually one right the way down here. Look, this island right here, we haven't actually connected it up. So let's get ourselves straight down there. Because then we can also go and activate something on the bottom floor as well, which we've been meaning to do for a while. You know what? I might actually be able to break my fall. If I tap that to deploy the air brakes, there you go. And one more time, tap, and then we're landing on the island. Perfect. Look at that. All right, pull you up, and then I reckon when we jump onto that star plant over there, this will be the fifth one. Oh, dude. I'm so happy this game got a sequel. Like, you have no idea. And away we go. Don't want to go onto too many of the spring ones. Just want to go to there. There it is, five out of five. Oh, the star plant is getting huge. Yeah, it is. Are we going to see a cool animation? Yes, we are. Okay. Oh, wow. There you go. It sprouted out. Oh, my God. That is a huge launcher. So it doesn't go higher than that. It only goes as far as there. So I tell you what, I'm going to leave it there for today, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you want to see more videos on this, please do let me know in the comment section below. I just love this. I, it's just so chilled out. It's fun. It's explorative. Explorative. One or the other. Leave a like on the video as well as a comment. And I'll see you next time, everybody. Bye.